Hey, good morning or good day guys. I thought let me start off the vlog with the items that I purchased from H&M and Zara. So uh, yeah, let me grab them. Bought some items from um, Zara and H&M. So let me start it off. Okay, so um, there were some sales at the H&M, so I thought let me go there. And I was like looking for a wedding dress actually, or a party dress, but I couldn't find a wedding dress, but I could find a couple of nice bargains. So I'm um, lately all into just like the basics outfits, you know, the simple shirts, the simple shorts, you know, I'll, I'll just, yeah, I'm just into the comfortable uh, stuff. So I thought, let me buy this black dress. Um, it's like a long black dress that you can wear. I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, so my the stuff here. But yeah, it's like uh, a long black dress, and on the back it has a split, so it gives it like a like a yeah, also a casual but also a formal look. You know, you can wear this with a jeans jacket or with you know like a a, a blazer. You know, so yeah, this is a black dress, uh, and then I bought like a couple of dresses. I bought this dress, and the previous dress was like 13 euros, so yeah, and not on sale or something. That was the actual price, and I bought it at Sara. And I bought a striped dress, <laughs> and this one was like 10 euro. This is like a skater dress. You can also combine this in all kinds of ways. You can wear like a, a long sleeve shirt under it. You can wear a jacket on top of it. And you can wear it for many occasions. So it's, it's always handy to have like dresses like these. And this one was like only like 10 euros. And which surprised me because the fabric is like super thick. So yeah super happy with this one yeah can't wait to wear it and then I thought let me, let me buy a white blouse I have a lot of like black type of these blouses in black but I thought let me buy it in white for once you know it's like a dangerous color especially when you wear makeup and you know you put it on you see like the orange of your makeup but I thought like you know these, these, these tops are super cute super nice super comfortable so i thought like yeah why not buy this so this one i bought for at the h m for 25 euros and yeah you can wear this for yeah all kinds of occasions uh for example yeah you can wear it to dinner you can wear it to work you can even wear this for like a job interview you know if you just yeah don't Put, you know you put a spaghetti top under it and a nice jacket and some nice pants and then you're ready to go for a job interview uh, or just a casual day out with the jeans under it so you can combine these kind of shirts with almost everything you know you can wear them with skirts pants leggings whatever you want so I love these kind of kinds of blouses with the ruffles on them yeah and what do we have? Yeah, and I bought this stripe one also in black. It's nice and I just love it because it's like figure correcting or not figure correcting. It brings out the shape, you know, so I love that. And um, it has a little bit of cleavage. Um, like I said with the previous one, the material was thick for like 10 euro. It has like a skater shaped form and you can combine it with like lots of lots of jackets. You can wear it at like different different events so this is like super handy to have, you know? Just the basic, yeah. And then you can wear them with heels, you can wear them with sneakers, you can wear them with slippers. Nice, always good to have some basics, right? And what else? Okay, I showed these, and I found this one 
on sale people who go regular to H&M must have seen these they're like on sale I don't know why they don't sell but uh, yeah you know they're like very comfortable they're a bit see-through but you know you can wear like a pinkish pinkish bra under it if you were like you know confident enough for it or you could say I could wear like a spaghetti band or a top a tank top under it so you won't see anything but um I love it it's like a long modeled uh, sweater <clears throat> has long sleeves I love it you know so uh, yeah this is nice to wear with the jeans with a skirt with a short uh, with a with a neatly looking pants you know black pants so yeah I love these these t-shirts where you can like make like a hundreds of combinations with so uh, of t-shirts I mean yeah so I like I like <laughs> and what else and I thought let me buy this green greenish pants <laughs> trousers uh, yeah so I thought like you know I need to get my sass back you know when I was like 10 years ago I would like wear the colors of the world all the colors and then I started to you know wear only black 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 you know and I thought like that this needs to stop and I need to you know be colorful again and try some cool colors out so uh, I thought yeah let me grab this one or buy this one and this was would look good on the sneakers with heels with slippers uh, this is like a great combo you know so you have like an edgy um, kind of rare you know combo you know because isn't it great when you walk on the street and you know people are like hey that's a cool combo instead of you look like is that off when you pass by and they're like ah, I've seen that outfit before but um yeah oh well you know the main thing that's important when you buy an outfit is that you like it you know that's the main thing but you know yeah you know if you just like combine it with this it can look cool or like a black top on it you can yeah you cannot combine this with everything or you can but for me I wouldn't combine this with everything so this would like not my kind of combo but uh, or maybe it could put some nice heels on there it's in a couple of years <laughs> but uh, yeah so this is what I bought so, okay let me clean this up let me put this in the bag okay guys here we go again the getting up face so far I'm doing good right oi, oi, oi. Oh, yes so yeah okay what do I have to do today um not much I just need to go um, uh, to uh, how do you say it again um, uh, the the townhouse to uh, extend my driver's card um, so I think I'm gonna take a new picture for that yeah because uh, nah the one that I have right now is like from ages ago and it's like time to renew that so uh, yeah I'm gonna walk up to the photo photography tour <laughs> and just have my picture taking and then taken and then I'm gonna head up to to yeah town hall or town hall sorry forgive me for my English sometimes <laughs> um yeah 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 and oh guys my camera is it's it's back isn't that a good thing <laughs> I was uh, bringing it to the store and the lady was like, uh, oh well, um, this falls under your guarantee because you haven't like, um, uh, you haven't let the phone fall or you haven't like bumped into the fo uh, phone, here we go, you haven't bumped into the camera so it all falls under your guarantee so it's okay and I was like, oh. I was silent. 
I was like, if I'm gonna talk with her about it, I'm gonna lie. So I was like, okay, let me shut my mouth. <laughs> oh my God. So yeah, so I didn't have to pay anything. They fixed an engine in my camera. So uh, yeah, lesson learned. So don't wax and film at the same time. Yes. <laughs> I'm so hot. Seriously, this day is like... <sighs> yeah, so I went to the Photoshop to take my picture. That all, you know, went well. And it's, it's kind of funny how they take pictures nowadays. Because I remember 10 years ago, you would like sit there and they would like, you know, give you some instructions on how to sit and if you need to put your hair back maybe if you need some powder or whatever but this time it was like okay sit not much you know communication on how and the what so uh yeah okay she took the picture and showed like this is it and i was like okay i'll have that one and then i saw her started to edit my my picture, you know, as in like getting rid of my acne or not my acne, my pigmentation spots, uh, getting rid of the greasiness in my face, you know, adjusting things. And I was like, damn, <laughs> wow. I don't think that's kind of allowed, right? Or I don't think that's wise to do because you need to keep with a, you know, with a passport picture or license picture. You need to keep it as real as possible, you know. But um, yeah, I don't know if I have it. If I have it, let's see. What? Let's see. I have it. Yeah. So okay, that 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 went well. So this is what came out of it. That, that's okay, right? <gasps> oh, so awful. Oh, well. Um, yeah, so that went well. So I had to the to towns hall, to the towns hall. I don't know how you call it, the local authorities, to extend my driving driver's license. So uh, they sent you a letter. Hey, come. And I know I've read that you don't need to have, make an appointment, you know. So, uh... I came there at the register, so I was like, hey, I need to extend my driver driver license. And she said, well, yeah, but you need to make an appointment. But I said, so I said, like, but in the letter said, I could just come in. And she's like, so no, sorry, it's not our letter. And uh, yeah, it's, it's a, they communicated bad to people, but no, you need to make an appointment. And uh, I'm sorry to say we're, f we're fully booked today, so I cannot squeeze you in. It's like, oh, please, man. And then I made a new appointment, so I got to walk back home, or no, not. I thought, let me upload my uh, traveler's card, because there wasn't like enough money on it for the bus. So I went to the shop, where they have the device. The device is not working. <sighs> so yeah, oh well, you know, at least I got some fresh air, right? Yeah. So uh, yeah, that is good. Just super sweaty oh I don't know if I'm supposed to show that but <laughs> it is what it is right so uh yeah hi 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 I'm gonna change shirts and I think I'm gonna end this vlog and just add another clip to it because this is ugh, this is nothing yeah okay later <laughs>